We begin tonight with new information about a gun found in the driveway at the Rockford Public Schools Administration Building early Tuesday morning. The Rockford Department of Public Safety says a city employee and firefighter who was off duty left their handgun on their car before bringing their child to school where it fell off and onto the ground. 13 on your side's Julia Gorman is live at the school administration building and Julia, you just spoke with the superintendent about this situation. Julia, good evening and what we're learning from the district is that this was a parent who lost control of that weapon and then it was a parent who found it and picked it up and eventually gave it to law enforcement. Now the superintendent told me just um, in the last hour or so that that gun was loaded, but he wasn't able to specify for exactly how long it was actually on the ground where anyone could have grabbed it, including a child. Now the Rockford Department of Public Safety says the parent who found the gun, uh, they put it in their car, they reached out to law enforcement. Law enforcement then came here to the admin building and secured that weapon. The department says the owner of the gun had again put the weapon on their car with the intention of bringing it into their home to properly store it. They were then going to bring their child to school and forgot they had placed the gun on their car and drove off. The gun then fell off the car and onto the ground here at the school site. Now here is what the superintendent had to say in reaction to all of this happening this week. He is always top of mind. Uh, we recognize that parents send their children to schools and, and the expectation is we have a way to keep them safe. And so here in our district, we've done a lot of things already. You know, we have secure vestibules. Uh, nobody can get into a school without going through the office. Even in going through the office, uh, they have to uh, uh, kind of log uh, or uh, use their badge to get into the school building as well. The Department of Public Safety says the gun was a legally owned and properly registered handgun. They also said, quote, the employee feels tremendous remorse over his error, and we are grateful to the citizen who secured the weapon and alerted police, end quote. Now, of course, the good news here is no word of this gun getting into the hands of any minors. No one hurt in this situation. Uh, we have been hearing a lot from folks in the community, you know, what is going to happen to this individual who, uh, you know, put this gun on their car and then it fell onto the ground while well, the case is being reviewed at this point by the Kent County Prosecutor's Office. If any charges were to come of this situation, we would of course let you know and I'll have a full story on this for you tonight at 11 o'clock. For now live here in Rockford, I'm Julia Gorman, 13 on your side.